here's another beautiful Chevy pickup in. Very nice truck. And as you know, right now, pickups are extremely hot. Been selling a lot of these. And here's your chance to own the most recent one. 1971 Chevrolet C10. Regular cab short box. Kind of a, call it kind of a medium blue. Nice looking paint on it. I call this a very nice driver quality truck. It's a great sound tool. And I fired up a little bit here to run. 350 underneath the hood. That has been built a little bit. You'll be able to tell when I fired up a little bit of cam to her. She has a little bit of rumble. Uh, power steering on this one. Edelbrock carb, headers. Nice looking tidy engine bay. We'll get around to the other side, pop the hood so you can check all that out. As you can see, it's riding on American Racing chrome wheels. Good rubber, Cooper rubber tires. Plenty of tread left on those for miles to come. If you want to check out the still pictures, you can see those rims, check out the underside, check out the engine bay, check out the still pictures. Down in the description of this video, there is a link you can click on. It'll take you right to the still pictures, and that's at uniqueclassiccars.com. You can also give us a call 507-386-1726. Be happy to help you out with this truck. The 350 underneath the hood is paired with a 700R4 automatic transmission. It appears that this truck originated out of Sioux Falls, South Dakota, and has kind of been in our area since, I believe, Northern Iowa into Iowa and then to us. It's nice looking truck, straight. You can see up and down the side of it, nice straight truck. Paint again, not full of chips, dings, nicks, scratches. Paint shows nice. Dual exhaust. As you can see, it has a soft roll-up tonneau cover on it. Uh, it does have a spray-in bed liner. I'd like to check that out. Um, it really kept this stock looking. Nothing too crazy been done to it. Some aftermarket wheels and interior looks like it's been redone, but kind of kept that stock overall look. Fuel tank filler is in the bed. And uh, if you, like I said, those still pictures, if you want to check out the the bed, see how nice that looks, engine bay undersides, still pictures can be seen at uniqueclassiccars.com or just look down in the description of this video. There is a link that will take you right to the pictures of this. But remember, financing is available on these classics. We do have lenders that work with us. We can also assist you with getting this truck transported to where you're located at. And we do consider trades. Again, take a look up and down the driver's side. Again, you can see how nice reflection luster that paint has. The chrome wheels look good on it. It's a nice truck overall. And remember, overdrive transmission. Automatic with overdrive transmission. Paired with that 350 underneath the hood. Cloth and vinyl interior combination. Door cards all appear to be stock. Let's go ahead and fire this up. A little aftermarket tachometer was added to the, to the steering column. Otherwise, retains the original radio. Wipers do work in this one. Tried those a little bit ago. Let's fire this up so you can hear it. See how easily it starts. It does have a little bit of rumble to it. Aftermarket oil gauge, I believe it is. Temp. Aftermarket temp gauge down there. And they've disconnected the stock one. As you can see, the battery gauge is working. Now here's the oil pressure is over here. Looks like gas and everything too. So it looks like all the gauges work, with the exception of the stock temperature gauge and aftermarket one has been added. As you listen to that 350, like I said, great sounding truck. Slip around to the back so you can hear it. Little rumble coming out of that V8. Like I said, it's got a little bit of a cam to it, it appears. I'm going to go ahead and come up to the front here. I'm going to pause this a second. Let's get this hood open and check out the engine van. Check out that 350 underneath the hood. All right. Here's the engine bay. Dressed up with some chrome valve covers. Air cleaner, it's that metal block carb. Headers added to it. There's a power steering truck. Nice, tidy looking engine bay. Car 
powered by the 350 V8. Once again, that's paired with that automatic transmission overdrive, 700 R4. There you have it, 1971 Chevrolet C10, regular cab short box, nice driver quality truck. Check out the still pictures, you can go right to them with the link that's down in the description of this video. There's a link, take your right to the pictures, that's at uniqueclassiccars.com. Financing is available, we do consider trades, and we ensure to assist you with the transportation where you're located at. Give us a call, 507 386 1726. Trucks aren't lasting too long around here. Get them while they're hot.